Hello guys, so today we're talking about this, um, movies is out, that was style and Netflix. Brand new Sally Favor from Channel Zero Team. Um, Netflix is adapting this for a novel that nobody has actually heard of. I actually haven't heard of it before. Cause it's all weird box. Oh, and the whole film prevent series of the Zowers out from a read about it, so it's set out to read the cast. Some other people will be in this show. Um, Catherine Carter, Eric Kwanz, and Zeph Ford and Manny Zatino will also be in this show. I don't have Netflix, so I probably won't be able to see this. I did see Under on that was actually a pretty great show. Um, I did see clips of the Star Trek sort that she was in. Like Bond, Star Trek, I have absolutely nothing, no idea anything about Star Trek, but, you know, that sort was completely, you know, terrible. And people were saying the new Star Trek was terrible anyways, but I was never interested in Star Trek. Um, but I knew Cherry Favor is the story where we reason Nova. Wait, Nova? Wait, her little name is Nova, and there's a character we better age called Nova. And that's just funny. As far as film director and son friends, for Smeary World of LA, who embarks on a mind altered journey from the streets of Beverly Hills and the forest of Brazil's, a supernatural event, so that's the entire story. The eight episode series is panned by Zao Zero, duo Nick Atoska, and Rayon Zion, Tao Zero, puts a block, director Escasa Stevenson will direct the plot. And that's all we know. You know, the Amazon show was awesome, uh, it was great. Um, and, and especially we about Angel, okay, we all know that movie is probably the best movie of the year. Um, I'll have to debate that once I see the Joker movie where it comes out on Blu-ray because I couldn't see it because it was a, because you know some people will say oh I don't want to see it. it's an R-rated movie it's unreasonable you know those unreasonable people who don't want to see Joker because it's R-rated okay yeah I know people who really don't want to see Joker just because it's an R-rated movie because it's you know well and it's the same person went to go watch out to go see The Incredibles day two day one but you know good thing I don't talk to that person anymore but. Um, as well as the most shooting goals as poison ever sees extremely beautiful as well. Um, the only thing she's bad is that Star Trek sword, but Star Trek is kind of a dead franchise anyways. Um, no one wants a Star Trek, okay? You know, when he, when, he, when the Orville is more popular than, than Star Trek, he, he got a problem with that then, you know? The Orville was kind of like, you know, was something that was supposed to be like Star Trek, but... Oh, basically that's it, so if you have Netflix, you should go see this. That's basically it. And of course, Netflix does have this over, you know, freaking Disney Plus. Fucking Disney Plus, but you know, they have their Disney crap. They're, they're, not, they're not gonna have any horror shows on Disney Plus. Okay, they're not, they're not gonna, okay? So, that's basically it. Goodbye.